Hey there, I'm CBS4 meteorologist Ashton Altieri in Colorado's Weather Center. We are now on La Nina watch through the upcoming winter. Remember, La Nina happens when the sea surface temperatures on the west coast of South America and Central America are cooler than usual. When they're warmer, that's El Nino. But this would be La Nina. The experts at NOAA's Climate Prediction Center say there's about a 70% chance of this happening by this winter. So what does that mean? Well, in parts of the country, it's pretty straightforward. Usually wetter than normal up here in the Pacific Northwest and parts of the Ohio River Valley. It's typically drier than usual across the southern third or so of the country, colder than normal for the upper Midwest. It's a little bit less certain for Colorado because with a La Nina winter, we tend to get the jet stream moving right over Colorado. And so if it shifts just a little bit farther east or a little bit farther west, it can mean a big difference. But usually, usually with the jet stream right on top of us, it means windier than usual conditions. It means colder than normal conditions because we get these Arctic blasts that follow the jet stream down from Canada. And then it also means drier than normal conditions. Typically in the La Nina winter, we get less snow than normal, but it can really vary. Last year we had La Nina in the winter time and some of us along the front range had record snowfall. So we'll certainly keep watching this and keep you posted as we inch a little bit closer to fall and then winter.